The atmosphere at the sold-out Dunkin' Donuts Center was electric for senior day today, but the Butler Bulldogs spoiled the party, and despite a great run by the Friars down the stretch, the Bulldogs pulled out just enough to win 68-64. But with 21 wins overall and 11 wins within the conference, Coach Cooley says the toughest part about today's loss is not being able to send off the seniors with a win. The thing I'm disappointed over is, you know, losing for our seniors. You know, I, I think you... You do everything you can in your willpower when you have these kids and you see them here for so long to to try to win for them. You know, you get a crowd like that and you, you want to win for your fans. You want to win for our incredible state, but more importantly, you want to win for your seniors. You know, it's uh, you got to put the regular season behind us. I am proud of where we stand today, uh, what, where our record is. Uh, I think we're locked into playing in the four or five game, depending on, you know, what color jersey we wear. But I think we're playing St. John, so I think that's our next focus. And, uh, you know, try to do the best we can. We're not going to define our season on a loss. You know, we, we got to look forward, have some energy, have some emotion going into the Madison Square Garden. And there's basketball left to be played. And we got to go down there with a sense of purpose and urgency. Up next for the Providence College Friars, the Big East Tournament in New York City at Madison Square Garden. We'll be there all week bringing you all the coverage you need after the games. From the Dunkin' Donuts Center in Providence, Rhode Island, I'm Nick Rojas, Friars.com.